Today I have a good news. OpenAI has recently tweeted that they are rolling out web browsing and plugins feature to all ChatGPT Plus users. If you are one of them, you will soon receive web browsing and plugins facilities. I have recently received plugins feature. In today's video, we will look into that. They are also moving from alpha to beta. If you have access to ChatGPT web browsing, you will be able to access internet data directly into ChatGPT. And if you have apps and plugins uh, enabled, you'll be able to do some amazing stuff. So in this video, let's go ahead and see how we can enable this. To enable uh, plugins, we have to go to settings, go to beta feature, enable this feature from here. Once we have enabled the plugin from settings section, we need to come and click on this GPT-4 and we have to select this plugins. You will find that no plugins enabled. We need to go click here, go to plugin store and we have tab for new, most popular and all plugins. So under new tab, you have all the new plugins which has been added. So let's have a look at the first one, uh, Portfolio Pilot, your AI investing guide, portfolio assessment, recommendation, answer to all finance questions. That's great. Let's have a look at the most popular one. So we have already seen this Instacart, Wolfram, Zapier, Speak, Fiscal Note, Open Table, Expedia, and Kayak, right? And then we have all plugin section here uh, where we have dev, keys, and so many, right? Uh, to go to the next page, you can go ahead and click on this next. Then we have install unverified plugin. So we'll have a look how we can do this. Maybe I'll cover this in the next video and how to create our own plugins. And here we can click on all plugins and you'll get uh, some information about like plugins are powered by third party. Plugins connect chat GPT to external apps and chat GPT automatically chooses when to use plugins or not. So that's great. So guys, I've installed Wolfram for now. So let's go ahead and install Wolfram. If you want me to do a video on any specific plugin uh, please put down the name of that plugin in the comment section i will make a consolidated video and post it okay this is already installed let's go ahead and cancel this one so we can see our plugin is enabled here so we'll go ahead and test this so i've logged in into wolfram uh, website and i'll take some examples from here it will be easy for us to you know uh, double check it so i'll go for algebra here uh, i'll try to take this one and I'll compute it over here as well and take this, provide it to our GPT-4 over here and click. Let's see if it is able to compute this using, uh, you know, Wolfram or not. So it says that, yeah, it is using Wolfram. That's great. So let's wait for the solution. So it has used Wolfram and we have solution for X uh, and we have graph as well, right? So let's go ahead and check out the answers here. This is amazing, guys. Imagine, you know, uh, doing any kind of homework or complex uh, task. It is able to use any plugins and uh, provide you the solution such a, in a, such a detailed manner. So this time I'm going with one physics uh, problem uh, where I'm asking to, you know, calculate the work in kilojoules. It is also the problem uh, from Wolfram Alpha. So let's go ahead and uh, calculate this. I'll just add this, you know, provide me step by step details step details so let's see if it is able to do that or not so we have the answer guys uh, it didn't go and directly give me the answer using wolfram because i asked it to provide me the steps uh, in details so it has given me a lot of information about uh, each parameter and then it has used wolfram and it has calculated everything and it has provided me uh, work done is three kilojoules uh, that too everything is given in a steps by steps not directly answers and then it has given some additional uh, answer as well. So let's go ahead and see the answers in uh, Wolfram. What was the answer here? So work done is three kilojoules here. So we already saw how amazing Wolfram is. Let's go ahead and try this speak. Uh, I'm not sure how it works. So let's go ahead and install this one. Uh, this is already installed. So let's get back to the chat and see here. We can see that we have two plugins enabled. We can disable and enable plugin from here. That's great. So let's go ahead and disable this for now and speak, learn how to say anything in another language with speak your AI powered language tutor. Okay. Uh, okay. How to say I love you in Spanish. So we have the answer here. Uh, it has used a uh, plugin speak plugins and we do have, you know, uh, formal and informal ways of saying that. Uh, and it has given some other details uh, as well. So this works really great. Uh, I'm going to try another language, uh, which is my native language, Hindi. So 
I'll go with the same or to say I love you in Hindi. So we have the results for Hindi as well. Uh, and I, I was reading and it's really correct. Uh, so now we can say that, you know, if you want to learn any language, you can just use this plugin and learn any language. Uh, this is really amazing. I mean, it has given a, a different, uh, you know, ways of uh, explaining things and saying things, uh, speaking. So it works really well and it has given example as well. So that's all for the day, guys. If you like this video, hit the like and subscribe button, share with your friends and I'll see you in the next video. If you want me to make a video on any specific plugin uh, please put the name in the comment section i'll consolidate and make a video about that i like this zapier and i'll make a separate video about this because this is a kind of complex uh, plugin where you need to configure a lot of things so i'll make a detailed video about that and share with you guys so i'll see you in the next video bye bye